Hello everybody, it's Mike here at Game From Scratch, and it's Black Friday. As long as you're watching this video today, uh, today is Black Friday. The chance to get a deal on all kinds of stuff in the world of game development is not exempt. Now, I used to always do a rundown of all of the sales that I could find out there, and I'm going to show you that from last year in a little bit, to show you why I'm not bothering to do that this year. But I am going to showcase some of the key sales that are out there, to just bring them to your attention, and then I will link that article, which will send you off towards all kinds of other deals on Black Friday sales. So first off, we have the uh, Unity Asset Store sale already going on. I did a video about this one at the beginning of the week. It's been running all week long with like uh, an individual asset featured every single day. And then uh, something like 400 items, 50% off across the entire store. I made a bit of a mistake in that first video in that I thought that the actual 50% off sale started on Cyber Monday or next Monday. I was wrong. The entire sale goes the entire time. Now, one of the cool things about this is since I did this, they actually released a code, um, a coupon code. I will drop it down below, below with the link for the Unity Asset Store. But if you use this, you'll get 10% off. You can only use it once, but it will give you 10% off your entire cart. So uh, if you find 10 items you want, you'll get 10 items at 10% off, as long as you do them all in one purchase. The only catch with the code they're handing out is you can't use it to purchase the daily special. So the things that are 70% off, you can't touch them. But if you want any of the Unity items, uh, there's a code down below along with the link uh, that will enable you to get 10% off one purchase from the store. And as you can see, there's 408 items on sale here, quite a few of them. And there is that daily sale as well. I forget what to days is um but i did do a full video on that so if you want to jump into that th there's some pretty good stuff in here it's, it's a lot of the um, most famous or most popular things on the unity asset store that are featured this black friday so there is that one and then the next one obviously is there's no way that unreal engine was going to be left out of this love and so they have a black friday sale going on as well there's not really much of a theme to it it's basically just a black friday sale here you can see there are 5,000 items on sale here. Um, and the range, some things are like 70%. Uh, let's see if I can actually order by sale amount. Yeah, discount. All right, let's see what the biggest discount is. So 70% seems to be the biggest. But how many 70s do we have? We got at least one page of 70s. All right, let's jump forward. I can't. All right, so we got a lot of items actually that are full blown 70% off. Now, uh, there's no real focus or features on what they have going on here. So um, you're going to probably just want to browse through, see if there's anything of interest to you. What I would generally do is come in here and do it by um, the discount amount. So you can see there are some pretty pretty massively discounted things here. The other thing that might be interested is actually just going by the highest priced. I don't know why, but I always find that some of the most interesting assets are also the most expensive. I don't know if you agree with me on that one as well. But you can see there is a pretty massive thing going on here. Now, one thing to notice, this one actually is not just Black Friday. It's going to run until December the 4th. Uh, that would be, I believe, Monday. Oh, no, it's not. That's Wednesday. All right. Um, and the uh, the Unity one I just talked about runs till at least Monday. So you don't have to necessarily get either of these directly today. And a lot of the online stuff is going to run through Monday, which used to be called Cyber Monday. And thankfully, they don't they don't seem to call it that anymore, which is a good move. And now we're going to get into a, a, just a handful of the ones that I really want to focus on now. Affinity. Affinity is amazing. I've done videos on them. Affinity Designer is one of my favorite programs ever. Uh, Affinity Paint is solid. I think it's called, oh, sorry, Affinity Photo, a very solid program. These guys are both really affordable applications. Now, obviously, you can get something like uh, Krita or GIMP completely free, but uh, there's nothing in my world that compares to Affinity Designer. It, it's kind of a competitor to Adobe Illustrator, but it's like five times easier to learn. I love Affinity Designer. Uh, I, I'm okay with Affinity Photo. I've got licenses for both, but this is the one that really wows me. And when you look at something like um, Ill Adobe Illustrator, you've got to buy it for like some annoying subscription fees. It used to cost six or seven hundred dollars. Here you can see it's forty-seven or forty-eight bucks Canadian, so forty dollars U.S. Uh, for the version you want. That's pretty awesome. And there's also free trials available for all of their software. And kind of amazingly, they've actually got iPad versions of both Photo and um, Designer, and they're pretty much feature complete. So they're, they're definitely impressive products. So if you're interested in checking more about Affinity Designer, I actually did a hands-on video of it at one point in time. I love this program and I cannot recommend it more. Next up, we have Substance. Uh, now, this one is, it's iffy. Um, 
Substance obviously was purchased. Substance is, is literally the greatest PBR texturing application out there. We've got some up and comers. We've got really cool moves with Quixel being bought by Unreal and being basically made available for free for Unreal Engine developers. And Quixel Mixer being made available soon free for everybody, which is awesome news. Uh, but in the meantime, Substance Painter is the best program that's out there for this stuff. Unfortunately, they were purchased by Adobe. But if you are interested in getting an annual subscription for Substance, you can get it for $159 instead of $239. Now, there is always a discount at Substance. It's nice to see that uh, they're continuing it on uh, during this Black Friday. Uh, but again, they are now subscription-based, which is a little irritating. But yeah, it is what it is. It's still a nice... It, it's an excellent application. It's just a terrible owner. Um, of course, every year you've got the Steam sale. I, I'm not going to get into the level of detail I used to in the past for reasons I will again show you in just a second. But if you are interested, there's almost always the same stuff on sale here. So you see things. Pixel Game Maker MV, 35% off. Marvelous Designer, 30% off. Um, generally, you'll actually even find Substance on here. Let's see if it's here. And this is the way you can get a perpetual license. Yeah, so if you want to get the perpetual indie license, this is how you buy it. Now, interestingly... Oh, no, it is on sale. All right, that's very predictable. Um, but this is actually technically not unlocking until the 17th. But um, this is the only way to get a perpetual license for indie developers now. Just do be aware that if you buy Substance this way, you do have to uh, uh, hit certain income threshold limits. Uh, so I'm, I'm, I don't know what they are offhand. I think it's a hundred grand it might be 200 uh, But you need to make less money than that to qualify for the indie versions But if you do want a non-subscription version, this is the way you buy it uh, So that is an option as well. So the steam sales are always pretty thorough There's a, there's a fair bit of stuff in here and then here's why I am not going into a huge amount of detail on all of these things. This is my uh, Black Friday game deals for from 2018. So last year I put this together. Um, and I found that I've actually been doing this for like three or four years now. And the year before I, I did it. And then I found I could just copy and paste and uh, almost everything is still true. So here we go. 3D Coat. Let's see what's going on with 3D Coat. Hey, look, 3D Coat's having a Black Friday sale, $100 off. Uh, let's go back over here. Exact same deal, currently $100 off. All right, what about Adobe? Uh, well, what about Adobe? Uh, Affinity, our featured earlier on, 30% off. Exact same deal. Substance, 33% off. I think it's the exact same deal. Um, and then we got some various different Amazon stuff. None of that's going to be valid anymore. I should just cut that out of there, but I don't really care. Um, CG Trader, let's see. They've up to 50% off on models. Do they have a Black Friday sale this year? Yes, yes, they do. Uh, okay, so let's keep going on down. So we got Foundry, 30% off on Moto subscriptions. And now, what's the deal? Oh, look, 30% off Moto subscriptions. So you see why there's a sameness when it comes to uh, what's going on in the land of uh, uh, game development for uh, Black Friday. There's nothing really shockingly new. Uh, but there is, I, I will link, so the 2018 guide will still be linked up. Um, and what you're going to probably find, so everything here, I almost guarantee is still going to be on sale. So if you want to save on some Udemy courses, they're always running the $10 sale. It's just a thing that they do. The asset, Unity Asset Store is obviously different than this one. They did bundles last year. The Unreal Engine Marketplace is still going on as well. Hey, we're up from 3,100 items and down from 90 to 70, but otherwise we're looking pretty much the same deal. So I'm going to link the 2018 guide. Um, even when you come here and you take a look at the, uh, so let's say, Steam, we've got the autumn sale. So let's see, what might you be interested in here? So um, let's see, RPG Maker. Let's see if it's on sale. How's it doing? RPG Maker, 75% off. All right. So save 75%. What was it last year? RPG Maker was 70 to 80%. Wow, we're really consistent here, aren't we? Uh, what about uh, 001 Game Creator, 60% off? And if we fast forward, we've got... 70% off this year. So you're going to find the numbers have changed slightly, but if there's anything in this list that looks interesting to you, there's a pretty good chance that it's now discounted. Of course, this is now 2020, and that's about the extent of the differences. So again, I'll just link the 2018 guide down below, but it's amazing the consistency of these Black Friday deals. Now, what I do say is if you found something that isn't on this list and I didn't talk about here, do let uh, everybody else know. Uh, it is a great time of year to save a bunch of money. Uh, another thing to check out is a number of the stores out there uh, also have pretty solid Black Fridays. That's actually where you kind of see Black Friday really shine is in the physical goods side. Um, I actually purchased my new laptop today. I've been looking for one for forever, but I just found this generation was just way overpriced. Um, 
but uh, Razer has, I don't know, I got 350 bucks off. Um, Dell has some decent sales going on, Lenovo, the Microsoft Store. So if you're looking for some hardware, there's a pretty good selection of things out there as well. And another thing to keep in mind is this one. So I've got uh, a number of Humble Bundles going on right now. I don't know if you've seen them, but I do an individual video for each one of these things. I will link uh, each deal down below that's still running. Uh, but these tend to actually Humble... Humble is kind of ruining Black Friday for me to a certain degree because the Humble deals just seem to be so much better than what you get on a Black Friday deal. But anyways, the ones that you should probably be interested in, again, I will link each one of these down below along with a link to last year's guide and the two sales as well as the code for the Unity 10% um, additional off. Uh, but here we got Painter Bundle. So if you didn't pick this up the last time, you can get Corel Painter 20 or uh, oh, I forget the exact version of it. Sorry. But you can get Curl Painter for uh, a really heavy discount. It's one version out of date, but you can upgrade. Uh, there's the 2D animation package, which is Crazy Animator 3 Pro and Crazy Talk uh, 8 Standard. Um, community feedback to that one is that they kind of suck. Uh, I don't have any experience with them yet. I still intend to get hands-on with uh, at least Crazy Animator to see if it's worth picking up. But when you're looking at 25 bucks to get the, uh, an animation package, it may be worthwhile to you. It also comes with a number of... Um, plugins and courses and all that kind of stuff to go with it as well and then kind of winding down we've got the unreal engine game development thing this is a bunch of courses from gamedev.tv you got four days left on that one uh, and then you've got the music and sound effects pack from game dev marketplace and that one still has 11 days left but i've done a video on every single one of those things so i will link all of them down below but in some ways like i said earlier on the the deals for um uh, humble bundle just kind of put most of these deals absolutely to shame, except for, of course, where we started things off. This one uh, is pretty solid, so if you were looking to get an asset from the asset store, these are good real deals on real products. Ditto with the Unreal Engine Marketplace. Those two are definitely, if you're an Unreal Engine or um, a Unity developer, those are definitely worth checking out. But the rest of these deals you will find are well, they're very consistent year over year. <laughs> so like I said, I'll, I'll link last year's thing. And if you have any more suggestions beyond what I've done, please let me know. Um, they can definitely benefit uh, other people. It, it, so uh, if, if you've got a link to share, that would definitely be cool. Oh, you know what? I do have one more that wasn't on here. All right, here we go. So we've got Blunder Market has a sale on right now. It's their uh, biggest of the year. Get 25% off over 900 products from now until Monday. So that is a new one to this year. I don't think I featured it last year. So if you're looking for uh, commercial Blunder assets, this would definitely be worthwhile to check out. And then the other one is you can get a discount on CG Cookie. CG Cookie. Here we go. Uh, so they have... Blessed Black, 25% off, and a free Blender gift. Let's go get it now. So if you're looking for some training material, CG Cookie is running at 25% uh, off a one-year subscription. And a free, free asset pack with 65 low polygon assets at $25. So those are two new ones this year that I didn't have last year. But other than that, that's Black Friday in a nutshell. Again, I might just be getting a little burned out on this stuff. Uh, but let me know what you think of this year. Also, again, if you find something I didn't feature, let me know so we can share it with everyone else down below. All right, that's it. Talk to you all later. Goodbye.